An effective asset management system empowers a company to manage its portfolio assets with ease, resulting in a streamlined and efficient allocation and management of these resources. With the help of great HR, you can easily manage assets in an organized and systematic manner. This video will show you how to allocate assets to the employees. The assets provided by the organization to their employees, such as laptops, mobile phones, and data cards, are recorded and maintained with the help of the Great HR Asset Management module under various asset groups such as IT facilities and admin. Let's see it in action. From your Great HR Admin login, navigate to the Assets Management and then go to Asset Management page. On this page, you can view and manage assets allocated to the employee in your organization. In the overview section, find a list of asset groups that are currently available in your account, such as the asset category description, the total number of assets available in that category, the allocated numbers, available numbers, and also the total value. Click here to view and manage the asset groups. Click here to create a new group. Enter a description and save. You can view the new group with an option to edit and delete. Just click here and start adding the assets and simultaneously assign a user. Please note that only the user you add here can allocate these assets to employees. Return to the asset management page to add an asset to a group. Click on register tab. Click on add assets to fill in the details. The asset number will be captured in the system automatically. Choose the appropriate asset group and asset type from the drop-down list. Select the asset and asset type. Type a description. Select the location. You can upload the image of the asset using the upload image icon. Then type details such as the brand name, model, serial number, purchase date, invoice number, original value, and current value in the appropriate text boxes. Use the yes or no checkboxes to share the warranty details. Also, you can upload a file containing the details about the assets. Enter the remarks and click save. Now it's time to allocate these assets to your employees. As mentioned earlier, the named user that the admin assigns to a particular asset group can only assign assets belonging to that group to the employees. Click the register tab and find the existing list of assets and their associated details. Click on allocate and select the employee. Enter the allocation date and remarks and click on allocate. Now, come back to the same page. Simply click on return and record the returned asset when it's required. Once the asset is returned, you can allocate the same asset to any other employee by following the same process. Also, use Great HR's Excel import feature to upload your employee's asset allocation details in bulk. I hope you are clear about allocating and managing an asset to an employee easily. With that, we come to an end. Please like and subscribe to this channel for updates about our upcoming videos.